Hello everyone, your host Gaurav Bakshi. Today we will be discussing how you could move your 2D drawings into a 3D model with little to no effort. What benefit would we gain from this you might ask? 3D models allows us to do things as easily visualize the true shape and size of the part. Perform virtual strength tests in the form of FEA studies. Check for fit and function in the overall product assembly. And create machine code from the model. Let's just see how easy Solid Edge can get you there. Alright, let's begin. Solid Edge support different type of file formats such as DWG and AutoCAD document. Before we open that file, let's see various import options. First and foremost is the preview option. Left hand side you can see the layers which I can turn off and on up to my requirement. The other file import options are sheet scale setup, line width, line color, etc. etc. Now let's go ahead and open the document. Yes, I want this to be an ISO template. Once the drawing is open, you will see the same thing as you saw in a preview. For a better clarity, I will go ahead and hide few layers. Now let's convert this into 3D by using our create 3D command. Uh, yes, again, an ISO template. The drawing should be in a third angle projection. Now let's go ahead and fence select the front view. I'll do the same with our side view as well and then I will create a four line in the center of the sketch. Let's do same with our top view as well. Fence select the view, creating set four lines at the center of our sketch. So here we are in 3D. This shaded area is known as region and we can simply pull it out to create a 3D geometry and snap it to the side. Next, we need to create the feet of the model. Again with simple drag and snap. Next up is the stiffing ribs and don't worry if you need to reuse the AutoCAD model. You just have to restore the sketch like this. Once more, a simple drag and a snap. Angling these ribs is nice and easy. What we'll use, we call the steering wheels to rotate the face of the model. with the simple drag and snap to the AutoCAD sketch. But what do you think what would happen at the back of the model? Don't worry, synchronous technology have taken care of it as this is a symmetrical part. Great, all sorted. And if we need to edit the design, we absolutely can and with ease. For a better visualization, I'm just hiding the sketches. Let's just start with the angle there. Let's change it to 35 degree. What about this fillet? All right, let's just revert it back to 45. What about the radius down there? All right, let me, let's make some changes and make it 200. Another way to add it is by dragging face like we did earlier. And here you would notice as I take the face out, the dimension update to suit. We also have the capability to add in our own dimension. Here I want to make changes, changes with width of my foot. We can simply apply the dimension and make the changes right there. Holes can be edited in the same way. Or if we, knew, if we need to make the change in the type of our hole, we can use this tool called Raggagrass Hole. Now we can change this for, let's say for an example, to a counterable hole. 
just with one step here you can see that I have changed the type of my hole. As this is a steel part and the material of course is needed. Notice Solid Edge has a complete library of a material to choose from and once set we can find the component weight and do the strength test. With the ability to create custom quick shit draft template in Solid Edge We can instantly create a drawing of our 3D model. Dimension can be automatically retrieved and any other change made to the model will be reflected on the drawing because of their connection between part and draft. So in summary, it's quick and easy to convert 2D files into 3D with Solid Edge and it even allows you to make further design changes in 3D. In this case, with those original AutoCAD 2D dimensions, Get the benefit of 3D CAD but save the time by using 2D data. Solid Edge, design better.